I like controllers. That's... <laughs> Whew, I'm, glad, I'm glad I finally got that out there. But, no, seriously, I clearly have a passion for controllers. I know I've been a bit laser-focused over the last handful of years only on the Steam controller, but I am very passionate about controller input, controller remapping, controller ergonomics, you know, the whole bag. So just giving you a little context of why I'm pimping out a Kickstarter, because I think this is really cool. So I just wanted to sort of you know, share it with you, maybe start a little conversation around it, because it's pretty rare that we get innovation in the controller sphere. It's like, it's been like for freaking 20 years now, man, that we're just like stuck with very standard controllers. So anyways, is this perfect? Let's get that right out of the way. No, it's, it's aimed specifically at one thing, simulation style games. And I think it's pretty freaking cool for that. So, I mean, clearly it's the way the whole controller pivots and twists, that that's the novelty. But the thumbsticks have a Z axis. And that, I'm really curious, like what kind of pressure that that? I wanna find more of just a picture of it. I mean, yeah, so that, that would be really cool for a flight game. But you're also gonna have these hat switches, which I think, what did it say? That they're, it's like the bumpers are hat switches too? Can I find, yeah, I think that might also be a hat switch, which is giving you another joystick. Unless I'm totally ignorant to the Sims fear, light Sims, hat switch means that it would be an analog stick, correct? Or is it more of just a four directional D-pad? Regardless, it's not just a single digital input. Oh yeah, there, there it is. Ooh, 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 doggy. All right, we got, all right, four times, four five-way hat switches. Meaning up, down, left, right, in. I guess I don't have a flight stick, so I'm not super familiar with how hat switches work. But like I'm saying, that still gives you uh, I guess, well, shit. I mean, how could we remap that? I guess it's gonna have to come with its own remapping software. Steam input probably wouldn't know how to translate all those axes. Maybe Rewazd will support it. We have 26 digital buttons, nine axes. Axes. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna, stress over that. Did I say it right? I'm pretty sure I did. But yeah, I mainly I mainly just wanted to share this with folks. I mean, I, I did make a community post on YouTube. I don't, I don't know if people even really see those. But I, yeah, I wanted to just mention it also because I am I am finally branching out and starting to use other controllers, and this came up kind of right at that same time. So yeah, I mean, I, I I pledge to it. I think it might be a little bit of a challenge for it to make its goal just because it's such a niche thing and that price point, people are probably gonna think that's expensive, but I mean, I don't know. A custom controller like this, and if you would compare it to like getting two flight sticks, I mean, I was recently looking at getting two good flight sticks and that was like, with shipping, uh, I mean, I was pushing over like 400 bucks, 450, I think, versus two uh, VKB sticks. But this, yeah, like, so what don't I like? Doesn't have a gyro. That's that's a huge nut punch. But I mean, having the gyro might it would be tricky with the way you're twisting it, as far you know. I don't know. But I think that that'll be that'll be a nut punch. But all these other options I am still intrigued. Plus it is 
it's not, you know, it's not meant for first person shooting. It's not meant for a platformer like this. It's meant for flight sims. And for that, it looks like it's, it's checking off a lot of boxes and doing some super cool and interesting things that I would love to get my hands on. Like, even if they don't make this Kickstarter, like, do custom orders or something. I, <laughs> I would love to try this thing out. Look at that. Look at that, pretty boy. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm, I'm so intrigued by this thing. It is so... It is so unique. And that is a breath of fresh air in the controller sphere. It's pretty rare that we get different things. Yeah, I'm, I'm on board. I hope they can make their goal. And that's pretty much all I got. And yeah, um, I'm testing some new little visualization. Trying to figure out a way that I could show, like, gyro. If I'm using a rewazd. But it only works for mouse output. Because I know you were curious about that. Because I kind of like to just ramble and just keep on talking. I mean, I can keep on talking. I, I can just keep on going. Even this 